Hey guys, this is Versatile from VST Power. In today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how simple it is, now it is, to play Serious Sam BFE before first encounter, play it online using the Green Luma method. Now, coincidentally, I don't have the game, but that's okay because I got a game volunteer, Hedraga, sent me some files and sent me uh, his gameplay footage video, so we'll talk about that a little bit shortly later. But what do you need? Well, first of all, you got to install the game, of course, and then go to my more info section. I got a link where you can download the Serious Sam BFE update as well as the fix, install the update, and then install the fix into your main game folder. And I also extracted out the readme.txt file, but here it is again. So basically, bottom line is install Steam, install the Green Luma. So here's my Green Luma program, sweet. And then go ahead, get the update, and then install the updates and the network fix into your game, and then start Green Luma, start the game, go ahead and invite people to your game, or join someone else's game, and I'll talk about that in the video. Now, you see that I don't have Tungle here, but yes, there is a Tungle network for Serious Sam BFE, and I will update the wiki later on to include the instructions. So with that said, let's go straight into the gameplay footage tutorial. All right, here we are at the main menu of Serious Sam 3. So we're gonna go to Options, go to Multiplayer Options, and that's where you can change your player settings. So go ahead, change your character as you see best fit. All right, that sounds good. Let's go back. And let's go to network play. So this is where you do co-op or versus. So what we're going to do is actually do a co-op. If you want to host your own server, go to start server. Select whatever mode that you want. Go ahead and start whatever settings that you want. Whatever the map, whatever the level, and you're good to go. So let's go back. And we're going to go to join someone else's game. Or you could do a server list as well. Because if someone's game is hosting, you will see their game in the list like if everything is working good with your ports and everything. So we see that RRR, RRR, Triple R is hosting the game, or you can invite the person, or you can find their name in the game, in the buddy list, and join their game that way too. So there's like two different ways of joining the game. Join them through the server list, or join them through the Steam buddy list. Or if you're hosting a game, you can invite your friends to join your game as well. So we can clearly see that we are in the game. So let's see how awesome it is. And let's see if we can get our butt kicked or kick some monsters butt. Oh yeah, let's get ready to rock. Here it comes. Good old hand. Alright, so we can clearly see that the game works out fine. If you have any nitpicking questions, leave a comment here on the YouTube page. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.